Welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. And let me just. I tried to do this video earlier, but I uh, got interrupted. Might as well do this now. Best to do this now, really. Let's see, how much should I take out? Let's see here. Um, 500, I guess. Maybe wondering, what the hell am I doing this for? I shall show you in a bit, viewers. Because it's something I forgot to do. But first this. Paula, where are you? It's time for a yummy piece of pie. How did I do his voice again? It was like, snobby accent. Yeah, that was how it went. The hell? Evil hippie over there. Okay, now where was it? There. The department store! It's too bad he doesn't walk up these. You have to just go with the stairs, I guess. Can't make it any faster. Hi! Can I help you? So, what are you going to buy? A teddy bear. Oh, how are you planning to carry us? You've got too much stuff. Well, I guess I could buy the stuff you don't need. Do you want to sell anything? What can you sell me? You can have this damn cookie. Cookie? I'll pay three dollars for it. Is that okay? Thank you very much. Is there anything I can do for you? you know, just buy the damn thing already. Come on. Ugh. Now this thing's gonna be following us around this whole time now. Now the slingshot, I'm not sure if it's that much better, but still. Oh, come on! Are you serious? Um, I think... Uh, just get rid of one of the hamburgers, I guess. Oh, how annoying. Let's see here. Slingshot. Now I can buy it. Good. Good. Very good. No. Now I am out of here. Let's go, Mr. Bear. To the hotel. Which we should have done before we came here. Seriously. What a stupid thing to do. I need health recovery items. Well, no. Just need to recover health and uh, PSI is all. Can I go there? Welcome to Hotel Tucson. A one night stay will cost you $50. Would you like to stay? Dude, that's a bit of expensive, isn't it? Ness, I, Paula, I am Paula. Can you hear me calling you? Help! Come and help me! Um, I don't know where I am. I can hear water running in the distance. Ness, please help me! No! So the music there. Hello? How about reading the newspaper before you go? Here is this morning's Tucson Tribune headline. A brave local hero named Ness who broke up the sharks that left on it. Reports that the mayor stopped the sharks have been proven to be false. Well, he tried to take credit for what I did. What an asshole. Mayor Perkle is a douche. And let's just get on with the plot. Well, not really. Because this get out of the way, old woman. There's still something that needs to be done that I completely forgot to do in the previous episode. Where was it? Where was it? Oh, damn it, I can't even remember. Wait a second, there it is. The Orange Kid. Greetings, I'm Orange Kid, the inventor. 
Have you heard of me? I'm a bit embarrassed about my reputation. I have a lot of intentions in the world, but I'm running short of class. I'm basically a heavy go lucky person, so I must live it. You know, I'm working on this machine that was really helpful in Tinsel West Valley. I thought he was ready soon. Yes? You actually win the head financial product? No. I guess it was just too helpful. Oh well, never mind. Dog Nerd! He's not the one that you should be going to. It's the applicant, surprisingly. Even though he's a freak. But there are both freaks. Hey, what's this? A broken machine. Hey, Mamaris, no one has given me a name yet. Well, I have sort of neglected doing my housework. I know it's a bit of a pigsty, but anyway, I'm Applegate. I haven't taken a bath in quite a while, so I may be kind of stinky and disgusting. By the way, I'm starving. Do you have anything to eat? If you do, can I have some? What can you give me? Oh, fine, have a hamburger, you son of a bitch. Thanks. You seem very nice. Uh, I wonder if maybe you would like to invest some money in my inventions. Dude, we give you a hamburger is not enough investment. Sure. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Excuse me, I mean, thank you. By the way, I could really use two hundred dollars. Sure. Thank you, I won't let you down. Better not, you son of a bitch. I thought I can walk there. Hey, my mouse, no one has given me a name yet. You look, you took care of my master. In return, I want to give you this. Please take it and say nothing. What is it? Nesk got the receiver phone. Oh. I must be in your way. Zip. Indeed. After that very, very... Wait, no, it's a period, dumbass. This is taking quite a while. He's outside the house now. But Paul is not home yet. It's if ever it's wrangling park with no something. Oh boy, I'm really worried. I can't keep up with a snobby voice, I keep forgetting to do that. Well, off we go. Where are we going again? Happy, happy village. We're on our way. How is he dragging that bear with him anyway? He's not holding on to it. Damn it. Are you serious? I can one-shot these guys now? Wow this. Peaceful rest valley ahead. Proceed through cave. What was happy happy village? What the hell? Hmm. Another cave tunnel thingy. What the hell is that? Okay, we're being attacked by mobile sprouts. Okay, game. You dumbass. Oh yeah, and I should explain. The teddy bear will usually protect you from attacks from the enemy. As you can see, it's been directed at the teddy bear. So the teddy bear is the one that gets attacked half the time, while you get off scot-free. Keep in mind that the teddy bear does eventually get knocked out. Die! Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no! Cheap bastard. Oh. This battle's taking longer than it should take, seriously. You better not summon a no when I'm gonna kick your ass. Imagine if I didn't have the bear with me right now. Well, my PSI would be gone. Oh, you son of a bitch. This guy is cheap. Oh, come on. Ah, finally. How annoying. Give a lot of XP. Decent amount, anyway. Gained a level there, a new ability. 
paralysis or whatever. Who the hell are you? No. Stay still. Hum de dum dum dum. I'm hunting for mushrooms. I'm going to collect a ton. You can't collect a ton of them. There's only four. Unless you mean the other ones. What the hell these guys say anyway? I'm not an enemy. I'm just a regular mole. Would you like to know about how to survive battles? Nah. Well, you seem to know a lot already, even if you don't look like it. Indeed. If that rock came to life and tried to attack me, I wouldn't be surprised, to be honest, viewers. What a strange place. What could be... What the hell is that? What is that? A little UFO. Oh, I see this is what they meant about UFOs. Just no teddy bears hanging in there. He's still in the game. And a little UFO was destroyed. He had it coming. Seriously. Even okay, maybe he didn't, but still. What the hell's this? For some weird reason, a pencil-shaped iron statue is blocking the path. What? Dude, I've heard of many weird things blocking paths, but a pencil? Who came up with that? Can you just walk around it? I mean, it seems possible. Look at it. Look at it. You can clearly see a bit of a pathway that could easily just get around the damn thing. But no. He's not smart enough to figure out that's possible now, is he? But what you actually have to do is you have to go back. And this took me forever to figure out the first time I played it. One second, viewers. Damn bastards killed a teddy bear. For that, I will not... Oh, son of a bitch. That cheap son of a bitch. Is he still... Yep, he still got the cold. Oh, that son of a bitch. I don't... No, I didn't collect it, did I? Like an idiot? No, of course not. Alert! As his condition is critical, he will collapse if his condition isn't treated. Be careful! Son of a bitch. That's just typical. Heal yourself for now. Okay, it's official. Nez can aim for shit. He missed two times in a row and cost me quite a bit of damage there. I mean, damn. Damn. Hey, what's this? Hello, this is the Apple Kid. I've just finished work on this great invention. Get over here as fast as you can. This thing is so cool. See you soon. Slam. Beep. Oh, come on. Son of a bitch. Wait a second. This could be helpful. Oh, man. That was annoying. These guys keep slowing me down. Hang on a second. But he still got a cold, what the hell? Thought it was cured for a second there. Oh, it tricked me. I thought it was healed somehow. Okay, where is it? Would I need to go to the hospital or what? I don't know. I rarely ever end up with this kind of situation. How did he get it again? I can't quite remember, actually. Uh, hang on, where is the hospital? Um, do we talk to you? No, we don't talk to you. We don't talk to the doctor himself, if I recall. I can examine each one of you for thirty dollars. You have a cold. You're all well now. What a great doctor I am. 
30 dollars to get rid of a cold. What a douche. Pretty expensive place. In my honest opinion. Well, you know what, Beers? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back to on it and heal. Because that would be the easiest way, because it would be full completely free. And I'll save the game there just in case, you know. And I shall be back in the next part.